God is doing well. I think I got a little over anxious about the, the onions not bulbing because they are. Uh, I just thought it was just taking longer than I thought they sh it should. You can see all of them are bul bulbing. Even the little guys, the little young guys over here are. I uh, just thought I'd give you a quick update on the uh, the small garden. Tomatoes are doing really good. All of them just loaded with tomatoes. Different kinds. Some of them. Uh, I got gifts from uh, diff people and I had some seeds saved. So, and I didn't label them when I put them in. So I can't tell you which plant is what. Um, I think this must be the red Russian I got from Steve's growing space, uh, Steve in the UK. Uh, we we uh, swapped some seeds. And uh, as you can see, the girls are over there enjoying themselves. You would not believe the pupae that they have scratched up out here. I move them every day to a new spot in the, in the back here and let them dig and scratch for worms and bugs and what have you. You would not believe the vine borer pupae that they have actually ate that was in the ground. But I already had to pull out two of my winter squashes. I didn't think I planted anything that wasn't machadas. Uh, but I did. I planted some blue bayous that I got from Hoss 2's that was 100% germination. Only planted a couple of seeds, but I didn't intend to. I don't know how I got that mixed up, but I didn't intend to plant them. Uh, actually, I'm going to give them away to anybody that wants them because I can't grow them here. They already got attacked by the uh, vine borer. Took the vines out a couple of days ago and opened the vines up and gave the larvae, all the larvae that was in the vines, to the chicken. They had two about the size of this butternut on there on the vines and uh, I thought well why not cook them like you would summer squash and see how they are and that's a can can Canada crookneck over there at the end oh uh, I don't know if you can see it from here but there's another one right in there that doesn't look like it's gonna get very big anyway uh, I cooked it like I would a summer squash with onions. Uh, I cooked them some courgettes like that over in the... Uh, they call them courgettes over there. We call them zucchinis here. I cooked some like that with uh, visiting with my ex-husband in uh, Gozo and his... what was his parents' villa. They're dead now. But uh had unexpected guests for lunch and and I cook those like I, we cook them here, stewed with onions. And uh, the guest that unexpectedly showed up was crazy about them. <laughs> I don't guess they had ever had them like that. The peppers are all doing really good. And the sweet potatoes have gone crazy. It's a chore now to keep them to where Danny don't chop them off. Blueberries are starting to get ripe, so... The birds are having most of these, and these, and I'm having most of these. <laughs> and by the way, I think I need to pick these. I see some nice big black ones in there. It looks like it's going to start raining here pretty soon. Got some strawberries ready to pick it up. I can see right there. So maybe I'll just go in the house and get my container and pick blueberries and strawberries and make this a very short video. Hope everybody's doing great. Have a wonderful weekend. God bless.